Hello, my name is Tim Black. Welcome to Coffee with Tim Black. You know, there's been a lot of conversation about Oprah Winfrey and a possible 2020 run at the presidency. Well, today, in In Style magazine, Oprah Winfrey said emphatically she is not interested in running. She said it's not in her DNA. This is not something she's built for. She Yes, she wants to speak to issues, but she doesn't want to run. Now, this is contrary to what her partner, Stedman, said right after the speech. Yeah, it was Stedman who gave everyone this impression uh, when he spoke with the Los Angeles Times saying that if the people wanted Oprah, then Oprah would run. Well, there may be some people who want Oprah to run, but there are a lot of people who don't want her to run. Because they feel we'd be right in the same position we are now with a celebrity instead of a person who understands government. Oprah Winfrey, very successful. Very, very successful. Never, t- I'm never taking that away from Oprah Winfrey. Very talented, very successful. But it looks like she is more focused on uh, continuing to be a media personality, continue to be a person who speaks on issues. And just in that she's going to be a contributor to 60 Minutes. So that's where her focus is. And now that we know this, now that we understand that this is not what she wants, finally, maybe, we can get back to looking to see if there's other candidates who may be able to challenge Donald Trump instead of hoisting up Oprah as if she's going to save the Democratic Party. More is needed than just popularity. We need someone who understands issues, and more importantly, a platform. Oprah Winfrey never talked about a platform, did she? I understand that, you know, the Democrats are looking for someone they think can be a contender, someone with a lot of name recognition, but at the end of the day, it's the people that matter, and I don't think the votes will be there for Oprah Winfrey, and I don't think her policies, I don't even know what they are, as a person who's been this in media, a media mogul, that does not necessarily mean that she would make a good president. So anyway, so maybe we can put these thoughts to bed. You guys can go about supporting someone like Bernie Sanders, maybe, or Nina Turner, maybe. Hmm. She's female. Maybe you support her. She actually has experience. Or a Toasty Gabbard. One of those people, maybe. I'll keep you up to date on this story as it becomes more uh, news about it or as it continues to go through our news cycle. But hopefully, and I mean this, man, I'm hoping that we won't hear any more about this, that we'll just move on and let Oprah do Oprah. Why can't we pick our own colors? No way, no way. Try the one that does it work. You four guys, all fighting over who's gonna be Mr. Black.